Hello nursery children, um, it's Miss Rooney here um, and we are going to read another story today. So I'm here with all our friends in the reading corner who are so excited to meet you and we are going to read The Gingerbread Man. So you might have heard this story before so maybe you could help me read it if you know the words. So it's a big book so hopefully you'll be able to see it this week. A little old woman made some gingerbread. She cut out a man with a big round head. She gave him a mouth and she gave him some eyes. She put him in the oven. What a surprise. And here she is, look with all her ingredients. And she's cut out a gingerbread man. She went to the oven and opened the door. The gingerbread man sprang onto the floor. He ran from the cottage and down the lane. The woman called stop, but all in vain. So here he is, look, he ran all the way out of the oven and down the lane. Here's the lame look. The woman gave chase and led the race. Run, run as fast as you can, sang the gingerbread man. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he goes, running down the lane. I wonder if she'll catch him. The woman gave chase and led the race. A curious cow followed them now. Can you spot the cow in the picture? Here he is. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man, he says. The gingerbread man was ever so fast. A horse by a tree saw him hurrying past. Can you spot the horse in the picture? Yeah, here he is. You look good to eat, said the horse. Come back. But the gingerbread man ran away down the track. The woman gave chase and led the race. A curious cow followed them now. A hungry horse galloped, of course. But the gingerbread man said, run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. He came to a river and stood on the side. He could not swim and the river was wide. Oh no, look, he looks very scared, doesn't he? <gasps> oh dear, I wonder what he's going to do. A sly old fox came up and said, you can ride across on my tail instead. The woman gave chase and led the race. A curious cow followed them now. A hungry horse galloped, of course, and a friendly fox swam round the rocks. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man, he says. My feet are wet, said the gingerbread man. Climb onto, the Climb onto my back, said the fox, if you can. They're still getting wet, said the voice in his ear. Climb onto my nose, he said, right here. The gingerbread man did just as he said. The slow old fox smiled and tossed his head. He opened his mouth and crunch, crunch, crunch. He had the gingerbread man for lunch. Oh my goodness me. So none of them caught him, but the, the fox got him, look, and the fox ate him. <laughs> run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. Run, run as fast as you can. The sly old fox ate the gingerbread man and there's the crumbs of it. And that's the end of our story. I wonder if our friend liked the story. Did you like the story? He did like the story. He's very excited to meet you. All of our friends are very excited to meet you and so am I. And when you come to school in August, we'll be reading this story and we'll be doing some baking of our own. So we might bake some gingerbread man and you can decorate them and then we can eat them. And we do lots of other things. We bake some cakes or some cookies or some brownies. And we also make healthy treats in nursery. So we might make some fruit kebabs where we learn to chop up some fruit and then we eat them. So we'll do lots of exciting things, lots of baking and lots of reading of our lovely stories in our reading area. So we are very excited to meet you and we will see you very soon. Bye.